Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, and Hazel's. <laughs> Today's video, I just figured we would vlog. Cause I don't know how to do that. I need to practice. It's not really like a day in my life because Hazel had like a massive accident on the floor this morning, right after we got up. So I kind of made the morning walk um, pointless, like for us to just, you know, run downstairs and go on a walk. Cause that's usually just to, you know, let her go to the bathroom. So instead right now, I thought it'd be more fun um, for us to go try out a new dog park in Playa Vista that everyone's kind of been talking about and see if maybe she enjoys that more because I'm not really in the mood to walk right now, so. Look at my cutie pie. Oh, it's really hard to tell in this lighting. I'll show you guys how cute she looks when we're out of the parking garage. Um, I did get a new car. I will be doing a tour or some kind of video dedicated to my new Tesla, but Spoiler, I love it. Um, and I was actually kind of scared that I wouldn't because I've just driven a big car, you know, since I was 16. So having this little car that's not gas, I was a little worried. Um, I was a little worried, but I, I really do love it. So stay tuned for that video. Um, for right now, let's just, let's just go to the dog park. See, you're so cute, baby. <laughs> I know Hazel loves this car too because she can actually see out the windows without being like on top of me and hanging out the window. So that's really great. But oh my gosh, I just think that's the cutest little view. Ooh. So this is Playa Vista. Um, up there is my dorms from my previous school since I graduated. Wah, wah. Playa Vista is just like a really pretty area. Um, extremely expensive. <laughs> it's just like pretty trendy and stuff, but it is also like a really great place to have a family. I like it down here. I don't really come down here often just because, I mean, there's not too, too much to do other than like eat really expensive food. So, and now we're at the dog park. It's actually a two section one, which is something I really enjoy, but there's no small dogs in the small dog section. So I figured we'd try the big dog section and so far she's doing good. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no, she just jumped into someone's lap. You causing trouble? We just got done at the dog park. Hazel jumped in every single person's lap because she's a bad dog doing bad girl shit. Allegedly, there's another dog park about a half a mile down the road is what someone in there said. It's like a dog water park. We'll see if I even let her in there or if we even find it. I definitely did not dress for today because I'm wearing a sweatshirt. Right now we're just headed back to the car. Um, we did not make it to the dog water park. I think she's getting a little hot. Oh God, that was like a dragon fly in my face. I think she's getting hot and that's fine. I'm also hot, I'm ready to go. Every single day. Oh my gosh, Hazel. The drama. So I was gonna stop and get a salad for lunch from, okay, from somewhere. Um, but Hazel seemed super duper tired in the car. She was like falling asleep. So I figured I would just come home and I'm gonna make spaghetti. So right now I just have some water boiling obviously for my spaghetti, but in here I have some meatballs. Um, they're just the Ikea frozen meatballs. I think they taste really good. I threw them in the pot with some olive oil and some Worcestershire sauce. This, however you say that, or Worcestershire, I don't know. Oh, those meatballs look so good. Now that is a cutie. Oh my gosh. Okay, sorry, goodbye. <laughs> Oh my goodness, that looks so good. I just put a little shaved Parmesan on top because I think it makes it look really cute. I also think this shaved Parmesan from Target's Good & Gather brand is really delicious, but I am gonna add some Kraft um, Parmesan dust or whatever. <laughs> delicious. I have my vulture here. <laughs> um. She comes and sits on my freaking shoulder while I eat. Just lay 
laying here with my girl, watching some YouTube, chilling out. <laughs> I did the dishes and some laundry. I still have so much more cleaning to do. Maybe it'll happen today. I say that every day. I don't know. Um, but yeah, tonight for dinner, I'm not really that hungry yet because, you know, I had that spaghetti for lunch, but... Every Wednesday at my apartment complex, they have a different food truck come and park at our apartment. So I try to eat it every Wednesday to try something new. Um, so I'll show you guys what that is when the time comes. Alrighty, I'm gonna head downstairs now. It's like six o'clock. I'm not necessarily hungry, but I'm like super bored out of my mind. Watching YouTube on my couch. So yeah, let's go see what they have. Okay, so I went down there and you know I like really do try to eat the food truck every Wednesday like if it's something that I don't have typically like I've never had before you know I'll like try to try something new but this is only like Mediterranean food and I don't like Mediterranean food like I'm pretty sure like every time I've ever had it I never ever like it for some reason so I'm not gonna waste my money. Like, I was like, oh, well, you know, I could just get a salad, but they didn't have any, so. Yeah. So I'm just gonna go straight to the car. Um, and I think I'm gonna go get a salad that I really like since I had pasta for lunch. So the salad place that I usually get stuff from, the salad that I came here to the mall for, um, they're still serving salads, but it's not coming with the bread that comes with it. And even though like they are still serving the salads, the bread is like what justifies the price for me. So instead, I decided since I'm not very hungry anyways, I would just get one slice of pizza. So we're not being, we're not being healthy today. I just got back from the mall and grabbed Hazel for a walk so she could go potty. She's already done that. I figured I'd leave that off camera. It's such a nice time of day to go for a walk because the sun like has just set. So it's just like really pretty and rosy outside. Like, isn't that just, oof, so peaceful. All these little homes, so peaceful. Do not be fooled though. These are all like a million five. <laughs> these are all really expensive um, for being like little, tiny homes. I like it here. It feels like the safest place I've been, even though me and Hazel have been followed twice this week um, on our walks at night. But I mean, we just kind of have like a target on us because like I'm a young woman and she's a French bulldog. So it was like way too much to be taken. If you, I, don't, I don't know, you know, I don't have to spell it out for you guys. Here I thought things were going peacefully on our walk. <laughs> Hazel stepped in an ant hill. So I just had to brush a ton of ants off of her. I looked down at her, she's got freaking like 50 ants on her. Good times. <laughs> I just, you know, took a shower, got on Instagram live and showed people a song that I've been working on called College. So if you wanna see that, you can go over to my Instagram. It's on my IGTV. Um, and now I'm just like working on editing this vlog. It's been a really chill day. Um, the content of this vlog is probably really boring, but I just really need to get better at like the editing process and stuff like that first because I just have really never done this and done it well. I'm taking Hazel on her night walk. <laughs> well, I'm attempting to. Oh my God. You wanna go? <laughs> Let's go outside. Praying we don't get followed tonight. It's happened twice this week. I feel like I already mentioned that, but you know. Luckily, I live in a maximum security prison. <laughs> it takes literally so many keys to get in my building. So many different keys. 
Y'all, can we talk about these yellow box flip-flops? I just found them after I like opened my storage unit and I did not wear them like since these were popular in freaking Texas, which was a long time ago. But I'm glad I held on to them. They feel like never worn. Okay, Hazel, please don't eat the bugs. And they're super duper comfortable. Luckily, like these are pretty plain. So please ignore my ugly feet. They're pretty plain. So they're not like embarrassing yellow box shoes. Cause some of those used to look like freaking miss me jeans, you know, where they were like all bejeweled and stuff. And that's just not really the style anymore um, or my style anymore. I should say but these these are like the most comfortable freaking flip-flops and i'm so glad i have them because i like own so many pairs of slides because i go through phases where i like buy one product a ton like fanny packs thigh high boots i've just like been through it all flannels you know and that was one of my things with slides i've never had a flip-flop phase <laughs> but damn flip-flops are like low-key way better than slides like on the comfort scale hold for airplane She just licks the pavement. And then I mouth kiss her. I give her kisses on the mouth. It doesn't rain here. The sidewalk is never washed. Never. Do you see this? Like, this woman has conquered an entire branch. I mean, she came in like a storm. This is not a dog. <laughs> this is a super villain. So we just went into Ralph's. Hazel played such a good job um, in the role of service dog. <laughs> Cause you're not really supposed to take in animals. I am the only person that is capable of going in somewhere spontaneously and spending way too much freaking money on food. Uh, no, I'm not the only person. I know my sister does that. So I'll just show you guys what I bought. <laughs> a little Ralph's haul, if you will. Um, I got two more packs of Siete chips in the nacho flavor. Ralph's, for some reason, is the only store that sells this flavor. Target sells these chips, but only in like lime. They're seriously the best chips. They taste better than Doritos. They're so flippin' amazing. And they're gluten-free and they don't make you feel like shit. And I serve them, like every time I have friends over and stuff and they're like, what are these chips? I've never had these chips before. And I'm like, they're good, try them and everybody ends up loving them, so. I bought some Cokes. <laughs> I bought my kryptonite. I try to buy the mini ones, so then I only drink mini Cokes. <laughs> and I bought some raspberries because I've been craving like sweet stuff so much lately. So I'm like, uh, maybe this will suffice as dessert instead of you just like driving to Beverly Hills for pudding, you know? <laughs> but anyway, guys, that is all I have for you today. I cannot believe I just got that video. Was that a big burp, girl? Okay, uh, bye from me and Hazel. I don't want to say this was a day in a life, but it, it was a day in our lives, technically.